Hello, hello today. Let's talk about our trackpad gestures for our iPad, which we are going to use with our new, brand new magic keyboard. Ay, 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 ay. So, how we can perform here a little bit gestures. First step is we can go to settings. Okay, first step is, of course, we use the trackpad um, to navigate through the menus. And if we mm, hover over in an app, the app will go a little bit bigger. And then you can see, oh, oh, I can choose that app, for example. And now if we push once, that means this is the click gesture. Okay, click gesture. Here we are. There it is. We are now in the general settings, but we are going down a little bit deeper into it. That means we go now here to multitasking and gestures. Okay, multitasking and gestures. That is the that is the point of it. We have here productivity gestures. Double tap with three fingers to undo. Pitch and spread with three fingers to copy and paste. Swipe left with three fingers to undo and swipe right to redo. This in productivity gestures, which you can use while you're working with that device here. Or we have five and four finger gestures. We switch apps by swiping left and right with the four or five fingers. We go home by pinching with our four or five fingers. We open the app switcher by pitching and pausing with four and or five fingers. That you can switch on or off, of course. So let's perform this now. We are trying now. We use four fingers and swipe. Here we see. No? Oh, yeah. We can switch between apps which are running in the background. That's a cool feature, okay? The same is if I um, swipe up. Here you can see I use four fingers to swipe up. The same is possible with three fingers. Of course, two fingers are not possible here. Now two fingers to navigate up and down in menus. Three fingers swipe up and you can go um, to that area here and use it. Of course, I can use two fingers, as you can see, to throw away the apps, for example. Rip, rip, rip. Easy peasy, isn't it? Yes, of course, it's really easy, you can see. So what's, what's, what's more? Of course, we can make the, uh, go back to the standard way, okay? We can click, okay, with one button click. And we can grab, and we can navigate through the menus with two fingers, one finger, cursor navigation, two fingers, home screen navigation, okay? One finger, push on it, hold it. And you can see here, uh, we can edit home screen, we share the app, we remove the app, for example, and this is possible with one finger. If we are push it and grab it, and I can edit it, as you can see. I can do this same with two fingers, and then there will be an extra, dipstra thing. Uh, for example, let's use here camera, one finger, you see, selfie, video, edit, okay, two fingers, push and hold, you selfie, video, we can short use this by pushing two fingers. If we push one finger, we have to hold it and then it will be go to the, that menu. We can, so, um, easy peasy use our gestures to navigate through everything. If we are in an app, I used three fingers to go to the um, overview. Let's go here to settings again. If I now go down to the bottom side and then swipe again down to the bottom side, we can see here we open the dock. Okay. And if we use two fingers for that, because one finger action, dock, two finger action, down, down, da, 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 down, go home with it. Okay, that means we go down, one finger, two fingers, three fingers, and swipe up, and you're back in the home screen. Okay, again, go down with one finger, you open the dock, you go 
with three fingers, um, with two fingers up and down, you can uh, scroll between the menus, for example. And you use three fingers to swipe up, you go back to the home screen. Really cool, huh? This is the scrolling up function, for example. Two fingers scroll up and down. And of course, we can make more. For example, let's go uh, to photos here. Here, we can zoom in. You see that? Zoom in, zoom out, zoom in. This is that zoom. We place two fingers near each other. We pinch open to zoom in or pinch close to zoom it out. It's busy and that is of course possible um, all with all objects. Go home, three fingers up, go home, baby. And of course, we open the app switcher, go home in the center, app switcher is on. And switch between the apps, three fingers, switch between the apps, which, which are open in the background. That's a cool feature, I think, three fingers. I'm going to use that, okay? Then if we are in menu, we can swipe with two fingers right and we see here, open today view, for example. Um, if we swipe with two fingers down, on the screen, a search function will be enabled for us. And of course, secondary click is possible if we use the secondary clip, uh, the click with two fingers. Okay, two fingers click, one finger click is that, one finger, two finger, edit home screen, for example, two fingers. Oh yeah, so you can see uh, we click with two fingers to show the quick action menu for items like icons on the home screen, messages in the mailbox, camera button, control center, or uh, different kind of it. Because here, for example, we can make um, pages, two fingers, new document, edit home screen, share. The new document is the extra behind this. These are only a little overview about um, trackpad gestures with your new um, um, Magic Keyboard, of course. There are a lot of gestures available and additionally, uh, it will be updated continuously, of course. That's the gestures for us and our iPad Pro. In this case, it's a 2024 version. Thanks for watching. Please subscribe me and give me a positive feedback. And I hope to see you again on my channel. Soon, soon.